Deciding whether to contribute to your 401k plan on a Roth or pre-tax basis can seem like a tough decision, but it doesn't have to be. I'm Shelley Fremel, Wealth Management Officer at Hills Bank & Trust Company, and I'm here to offer four things to consider when deciding how to contribute to your 401k plan. There are some general principles that your tax advisor will likely consider, and here are some of those considerations. First, think about your tenure in your career. Generally speaking, if you're young and just starting out in your career, you are probably earning less than you will when you're further into your career. It may seem counterintuitive, but in the years that you earn less money, because you'll be in a lower tax bracket, you'll want to make more Roth contributions and pay taxes in those years. Your age and your amount of your tax deductions also makes a big difference. People in their 20s and 30s and early in their career often have children and a mortgage, which result in tax deductions that push them into a relatively lower tax bracket. Now, if the reverse is true, and you think you're paying at a higher tax rate now than you will be during your retirement, then it makes more sense to contribute on a pre-tax basis. Keep in mind that within a 401k plan, you can make changes to the way you are contributing over time as your situation changes. So for example, you may start your career by contributing on a Roth basis. But as you gain experience and your salary grows, you may want to contribute more pre-tax. And remember, you can do both. Many plans will allow you to contribute on both a Roth and pre-tax basis simultaneously. This can be beneficial if you simply aren't sure if you're in a higher tax bracket now compared to where you will be later. Of course, no one knows what tax rates will be in the future. Contributing on both a Roth and pre-tax basis is a way of hedging your bets and can also lead to significant tax flexibility in your retirement years. Check with your tax advisor to help you decide which contribution option is best for you. If you have any questions about the benefits of participating in your plan on either a pre-tax or a Roth basis, please feel free to leave them in the comments below or reach out to one of our retirement plan services officers.